If you're leading a sales team, here's six things that if you do, will help your team perform better and close more sales. One, define your sales pipeline. Make sure the stages are set so that a prospect only moves through the stages once they complete an activity whether it's attending a webinar, sending a contract off to purchasing, whatever it is, it's only what they do that matters, not what the salesperson thinks. Two, have a weekly pipeline review. Shouldn't take you more than 15, 20 minutes. Remember, closed lost should never come as a surprise to you. Three, create a digital sales playbook. Everything your sales team does should be in the sales playbook, whether it's prospecting, your scripts, their calling scripts, your email templates, your documents, objections, the competition, everything. Everything needs to be in your sales playbook and it should be updated regularly as things change. Four, regularly, and I mean regularly like in every day, train your salespeople. Shouldn't take again more than 15, 20 minutes a day, but it's key to keeping their skills sharp and for thinking sales. When you're on the phone, you come in every day, you want to be thinking like a salesperson and daily sales training helps you do that. Develop a set of KPIs, key performance indicators that really matter, that move the needle, that aren't irrelevant. It should be things like sales, conversions of calls to meetings, meetings to contracts, whatever those are for your, uh, for your company, you should make those the KPIs that everybody is aware of. And six, and not to be forgotten, a pat on the back goes a long way to building a high-performing team. And someone does something good, makes a sale, uh, gets a meeting, whatever it is, celebrate it. And celebrate it in front of the group. Giving a pat on the back goes a long way to building a loyal and high-performing team. If you implement these six things that I just listed, you'll make more sales and have a higher-performing team. If I missed anything, why don't you let me know in the comments?